Hi everyone, Tuesday afternoon and me and Kyle are just off-roading across the quarry and this is a new girl that's just arrived with us today. Let me just try and negotiate where we're going, good girl. I don't know if you can actually see on the um, pathway how uneven it is, but it's extremely uneven. You've got to have um, a solid, sure-footed horse to ride around here, I tell you guys. So, the new girl, let me just see off this. her name is Flossie. She arrived with us um, about two hours ago. Um, and the same as, oh, where are you going, Kyle? Do you know where you're going? The same as normal, guys. We let them have um, an hour to relax in the stable and if they seem quiet um, and settled we'll pop out on them on a ride and actually we're a lot further today than we normally go for the first ride it's quite pleasant riding um, it's not too hot and she seemed lovely and settled so why not enjoy a bit of the um, cooler weather whilst we can so Flossie is, um, obviously she's black, she's a black cub, she's really, really beautiful looking. You will see um, some photos of her, oh gosh, I mean, I just to see, can you see the drop down there? Either side there's a drop. You've got to pretty much um, be trusting your whore um, now, especially one that is on her first ride. So it just tells you a little bit about the fact that I felt happy enough to come over this way. So going back to Flossie, um, you will actually see her full um, photos and we will give her a bath tomorrow and do some in hand photos as well. So you can see her. She's a very, very nice stamp of a cob. She's quite similar looking to, if any of you those um, have followed us for a while, you might know our resident cob dupe that she belongs to my mum. She's similar looking to him actually. She's got, she's Oh, we made it. Good girl. She's been very, very good over here. No, 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 not, that, not down there. Straight on. I'm leaving Kyle to do the navigating. And he's not doing a bad bad job, actually. Um, so, what's the matter? Oh. Going over a twig is, is quite a mission for Rick. She didn't even bother. Honestly, they, you would never believe that show jumpers um, would jump what they jump and then won't go over a twig. So, um, yeah, very nicely built mare. She's got, um, has she got three white stockings, Kyle, or four? She got four? She's got four white stockings and a white face, so she's really lovely to look at as well. Um, so, she, as I say, she's only just arrived and this is her second time she's been ridden in, in four months, guys. The reason she um, has been sold is she was bought last year for um, the lady who I bought her off for her mum to ride. And her mum isn't really overly interested. So, to be fair, Flossie never really got used. Um, but what they did do is just general riding on the farm and on sort of farm rides um they have to cross a very busy main road to go um she come from canic way so there's nice hacking around there um and some walk trot and canter in it like a schooling area in the field so she's only been used for your general riding activities she's 11 years old i will double check but i'm pretty sure her um her passport says that she is she was born 2009, so yep, that would make her 11. Um, she's, as I, I don't know if I've said that, she's 14 too. She's a good 14 too. She might even be a little bit bigger, actually. She's a good size. Um, more like a little horse rather than a pony, that sort of size. Come on, girl, walk on. No, I can get round there. Good girl. She's been very, very good. Very good. So today um, is obviously, um, as I've said, her first ride. So it is early days, but she's pretty faultlessly, really. 
Um, she's been in front. Obviously, we're following behind at the minute because um, I'm trying to navigate one handed. Good girl. And what we will do throughout the week is what we always do, bring some more photos, videos, that sort of stuff. I've got quite a lot of videos already of her in her old, um, previous home. So if any of you are eager to see more videos of her, um, you can just drop me a message and I will send those. So that gives you, oh gosh, now Kyle's got a nap. Yeah, you, well, yeah, he's gone too low. Go to the right, Kyle. Oh, we're stopping for a bite. <laughs> Thank you. That shows uh, she's quite happy. Hacking, nice and relaxed if she wants to stop and have a little bite to eat. Very nice natured in the stable as well, guys. She went in the stable, um, stood there quietly, stood there to be tacked up. I didn't have to turn. Hang on, let's go over here. Good girl. I didn't have to tie her up or anything like that. I could just tack her up, mounted her on my own because Kyle was getting um, Rick out at the other yard. So I mounted, oh, wise move girl. I don't know why Kyle, yeah, we went round the, the inside track. There we go. I tell you what, they're pretty good guys to be maneuvering around here. There's all twigs flicking up at them and um, Bushy's hitting them or hitting me. Good girl. And she's done all that, as I say, one-handed. I know we are following Rick, but she pretty much chose her own path at times. Through the spooky narrow bit. Good girl. So, as I was saying, lovely nature in the stable. Very patient to tack up and for me to mount. Um, we've had traffic pastas, we've had quite a few push bikes pastas actually today as well. She never bothered. And we have been out a good hour now. And she's not lazy guys, I've not had to keep lots of leg on, but at the same time she's been sort of like that. Hi. So, um, so this is Flossy and she's 14 to 11 years old, lovely black cob mare. Wait till you see her in the, um, in the full view guys, she's really lovely looking nice nature she's just done general um riding nothing um too extravagant but just nice happy hacking bit of schooling and all your general riding stuff but just bear in mind guys this is her second time she's been ridden in four months hence the reason she was sold because she was not being used um so yesterday she was ridden for just some um recent videos that um I requested before she came to us and then obviously today so it's, this is her second time in four months and obviously the first time with us so if she's going to be this good now how good is she going to be when she's settled and um back into the work routine um she's barefoot and she hasn't missed a beat either she's um been absolutely fine over all of the stones all the, the rough terrain that we've just ridden over she's never once taken a sore step so i think i would safely say she's um she's good without shoes she's got her legs clipped out as well so she do, she will grow feathers guys but she was clipped out in uh, winter so she was good to clip and those that she's got a nice um nice mane not too thick but quite a pretty quite a pretty mare loaded and traveled perfect in fact when transport transport got here they said oh we've got a lovely one for you here claire and behaved perfectly so um that is always a good start so she'll get turned out this evening with the mares and geldings um but she's happy in or out of the stable so i know that these cobs are in huge demand at the moment guys huge demand i'm pretty struggling like everybody else across the country to find them so when we do find them um, they do seem to be very popular so bear with me i'll try and get back to everybody and bring as much information as i can uh, via the voiceover um the her, her price is to be confirmed but we're going to be looking at top end blue and possibly purple thanks everyone <laughs>